Hey everybody. This week I would like to show you how to add text to your Photoshop images. Now, uh, our past videos have demonstrated how to open up images within Photoshop, cut out pieces of your pictures, and add them to other images, making a uh, montage of images. And so, today we're going to add some text. So, the first step is to click on your text tool. Over here on the left, in your toolbar, a little more than halfway down, you'll see a capital T. Go ahead and click that button. And then, what you will do is, on your photo, you will click and drag to create a text box. Now, you might want to adjust your font um, initially to make sure it's big enough for you to see. I have made mine at 250. If you click here and drop down the font, the largest it gets to is 72. So if you go ahead, highlight that number here, and type in your own number, um, you can get larger. And you might want to start out with 100 to 200 just to make sure you can see what you're typing. So go ahead and click in your text box and type in whatever you would like your title to be. And you can make your text box bigger if it doesn't fit the entire title there. I'm going to highlight my text here and click on this color button here. I'm going to choose a different color, black. Hit OK. And now my text is black. You can do a number of other things up here at the top. Uh, highlight your text, you can change the font. Uh, quite a few different choices here. You can change um, whether you want it regular, bold, italic, anything like that. We will go ahead and choose a bold font. And again, we will adjust our text box to fit my title. And we can center that text within the text box or justify it left or right. Okay, so now if I click my move tool, I can grab my text and move it wherever I would like. Okay, so the next step, after you've typed your text onto your picture, uh, we're going to add some cool effects to it. So over here on the right, in your layers window, you will notice you have a text layer. And so what you want to do is double click in the blue highlighted area, not on the words themselves, but anywhere in this blue box. And what that does is it brings up a layer style window. And here on the left you can see the many different effects you can add to your text. A couple different shadows, some glows, bevel and emboss, add different textures, satin, some color and pattern overlays, all just to make your text um, a little more interesting. So, to add an effect and adjust the settings of that particular effect, click on the words of the effect, not just the box. If you just click the box, it will add that effect, but you won't get the options and settings. So if you click the words themselves, you'll notice that you get a number of settings. And these settings range from um, the distance of the shadow from your words, how big that shadow is. You'll notice when I adjust this, when I drag this slider, it adjusts the effect on my words. And then the sharpness or blurriness of my shadow. Okay, and for a nice glow to my text, I can click on Outer Glow, and again I can adjust the spread and the size of the glow. If I decide I don't like a particular effect, I can just simply uncheck the effect over here on the left and move on and add a different one. Bevel and Emboss adds some 3D effects, and again I can choose uh, some settings to make it look exactly the way I want. 
And once you're done adding your effects, you can hit OK. And you'll notice that your text has taken on those effects. And again, you can drag your text wherever you would like, making your picture uh, look the way you like and have a nice uh, title that describes what's, what's happening in the image. So that's how you add text and um, add effects to it. Go ahead and check out some of our other Photoshop videos to help you with your assignment for Ed 421.